When you believe you're not enough, you'll overextend yourself with clients every single time. When you believe you're not enough, you'll add a bunch of random shit to your course that you don't really want to do that drains you every time. When you think you're not enough, you'll think the only way to make a difference in people's lives is to spend your day answering questions in Facebook groups and to offer all these like bonuses and one-on-ones with every, every course or training you want to do. And none of that's bad. I've done all of it. It's perfect when it's aligned and when it's what you want, when it's what you desire. It's draining as hell when it's what you don't want. You just think you have to do it to get someone to buy. When you're taking care of yourself and the other person's taking care of themselves and you have no need to get, get them to fix anything and you have no need to dump anything on them, it's like the relationship can be light. And when you bring something to them to talk about or when you just say what's going on or whatever, there's a, a lightness, a casualness, a hey, this is what I'm thinking, what I'm feeling, what do you think? And it is so much different than the way I did it for so many years where I needed that partner to be a certain kind of special, I don't know, source of something in my life. Like, I think a relationship can be a source of a lot of amazing things once you know you're the ultimate source and everything that comes from another is overflow. And it's that way in every area. Like, if I, if I didn't like myself, I couldn't create a company that I loved. If I didn't like myself, if I didn't love myself deeply, deeply I couldn't have a relationship where I see love, where I receive love. It's all you. It's all mirroring and reflecting you. It's all standards you forgot to set for yourself. It's all ways you forgot to love and show up for yourself. It's all things that you didn't feel worthy of giving yourself. And then we just blame business and say business is hard or blame men and say there's no good men in our in my city. But all along, we weren't just cultivating in ourselves what we wanted to be reflected back to us more. So in business, when I believed my work was of high service and worthy of massive compensation, other people started to believe it too. In business, when I believed my time was really, really, really valuable, people didn't show up in our DMs expecting free coaching nearly as much. When I believed that any amount of my time is sacred, any amount of my energy is a gift and a blessing, you price things differently, you show up differently, you set boundaries differently, You, when you believe you're not enough, You'll overextend yourself with clients every single time. When you believe you're not enough, you'll add a bunch of random shit to your course that you don't really want to do that drains you every time. When you think you're not enough, you'll think the only way to make a difference in people's lives is to spend your day answering questions in Facebook groups and to offer all these like bonuses and one-on-ones with every, every course or training you want to do. And none of that's bad. I've done all of it. It's perfect when it's aligned and when it's what you want, when it's what you desire. It's draining as hell when it's what you don't want. You just think you have to do it to get someone to buy. But when you know that you're enough and you know your work is enough, you know what you give is enough, and the, the question of worth and value isn't the question anymore, then you just show up and give what you have to give based on what there is to give and what you desire to do, not always in a mode of over overcompensation. Do you get that? When you're always trying to overcompensate for something, and always trying to prove something, it's like a, an uphill battle where you never get to the top because there's always another thing to prove. But when you're enough because you are, you can just show up and be enough because you are. You can give everything you can give, you can give it well, you can give it with heart, you can give it soul, you can give it with integrity, but not from an energy of, please pick me, please choose me, please validate me, please show me I can have a sex figure lunch, please show me that this business will work. Like I came at my business deciding it would work. I go into every launch deciding it will work. I show up to everything I show up to do with me doing the energetic heavy lifting of creating like the success. Like I know that me and God will do everything for me and then I can just support the client. The client doesn't have to sign up again so I have enough money. The client doesn't have to the student doesn't have to roll in every course for me to not tell a story that people just use my free content and don't want to do my paid content. No one has to do anything for me. When I just do all the things for me as far as showing up and deciding what I get to have and creating the results inside myself, then I can just do all of that. And then I can just give to people. And that is clean energy. I am here to give to you. You decided you wanted to do this thing. You paid the money for it. And I said, cool. 
so happy to have you. I'm here to give what I said I would give. Let's do this. I'm, I don't make myself responsible for your results. I don't think I'm bad or wrong or failing if I don't get the numbers I thought I would. I don't think my business is destined to never make it or going to go downhill if something doesn't go the way I thought it would. I just get to re-decide and rearrange and realign with what I want to occur over and over and over again and not put any pressure on anyone else. I keep it clean. I do my part. I don't put any pressure on anyone to do anything for me. And then they, you guys can sign up when you want to sign up and I can give what I said I would give and like nothing about it is validate me, make me feel better, make me feel worthy. I need you to be okay. I need you for this business to continue. Does that make sense? Same thing in both areas. And with clean energy, man, you're just free. You're just free to show up and do your thing the way you want to do it, the way you feel called to do it. And that's it. And that is what I have to say about that. Okay. I love you. Bye.